Nope. Mike Duffy is installing a battery in Boeing's latest X-Plane. It's called Phantom Swift. It's a 17% scaled flying laboratory that Boeing Phantom Works designed for DARPA's vertical takeoff and landing X-Plane competition. You can actually change the uh, rotor direction. That's airplane mode. That's helicopter mode. Duffy assembled a team of engineers in Philadelphia to design, build, and fly a remote-controlled prototype to demonstrate the design in time to meet DARPA's proposal deadline. It was a good chance for a lot of the guys to do like program work, full-scale large aircraft to actually see from start to finish they're in, in complete fruition, their, their design being flown. Scott Bauer says the ducted fans on the wingtips and two open body fans are pretty radical. He should know he helped design them and it wouldn't have gotten off the drawing board in time without rapid prototyping. With the capabilities that we now have in, in the, the emerging technologies, this is, this is a possibility, this is a reality. You can take an analysis and, and build and fly a scale working prototype in, in a month. Actually, for Phantom Swift, less than a month. It took three days to design, ten days to get the parts, and just two weeks to build and fly it. A three-day design cycle and a, a ten-day build, uh, there's only a certain amount of things that, that we could make or have ordered in, in that short amount of time. The picture is worth a thousand words, so I think, you know, a flying model is worth a million words. So, you know, no matter what words you put in a proposal to actually have hardware that you can demonstrate and they can tangibly see what is being proposed it goes a long way towards winning that proposal. DARPA wants something that can fly 400 knots, hover efficiently, and carry 10,000 to 12,000 pounds. Perry Ziegenbein says they considered a more conventional style rotorcraft, but decided to push the envelope with Phantom Swift's unique design. What's new with this configuration is a combination of body fans and tilt wing fans. So it gives incredible uh, controllability for the aircraft and addresses some of the uh, issues that uh, early models for ducted fans had is the controllability. Michael Mikashevsky is a composites expert. He helped design and build parts for Phantom Swift. This is what we graduate college hoping to do and give me given the experience to do that and the opportunity it's fantastic. Rapid prototyping is its the wave of the future, I guess you would say. The VTOL X-Plane competition will be done in three phases, so the Phantom Swift team could have additional rapid prototyping opportunities in the future.